Hello and welcome. Today I am going to talk about ITK snap color maps very briefly. Here you are seeing a T1 weighted image that comes from MP2 Rage protocol acquired at 7 Tesla. And I just cropped out a part of the brain image that we have here. And this brain image is acquired at 0.35 mm isotropic resolution. The link to the dataset is available in the video description. Now I am navigating towards the contrast menu and here you can see that I am changing the minimum and the maximum bounds of the color map. And the end effect is that you get whites whiter and darks darker and you also clip out certain values. Here you can see that I am focusing on stereogenerate occipital cortex. Maybe you can see that white line going through the gray matter. Okay, now I'm going to change, I'm going to invert the grayscale. So this is a quick trick that you can do one time and then start benefiting. Okay, here I am changing the first node from black to white. And now you saw everything become white. And now I go to the last point or node and then change it from white to black the result of this is that you end up seeing the image with an inverse grayscale which is sometimes useful some people prefer to like see their images in a different like reverse color maps maybe it can be useful for looking at some structures in the subcortex of course the information is the same but this is just a optimization for human eyes so to say and of course, we can change the minimum and the maximum similarly to adjust the dynamic range. Okay, the last thing is that we can actually save this inverse color map, which is very handy because you only need to do this operation one time and then you can quickly change it from the normal black to white grayscale to white to black grayscale reverse option. See, you can here navigate to the grayscale and you can navigate back to the inverse grayscale that we have just created at the bottom of the color maps menu. And of course, you can customize many other color maps like this. That's all for this video. Thank you.